Hi, my name is Penny. I bought my van a few months ago. It's a Holden Commodore X Ambulance Ute, 1995. It had done about 200,000 kilometres. And I currently live in Melbourne, Victoria, Australia, and I want to move to Queensland, which is about 21 hours drive away. I want to do that mostly for health and spirituality reasons. I have um, completely turned my health and life around over the past couple of years, and I feel that Queensland will help inspire me to kind of take me to the next level. Uh, it's a warmer climate, has a lot of health hubs, self-sustainability, permaculture, yoga, meditation, organic food, clean water, ocean, forests, and it ha also has all the modern amenities that you'd expect in any main city. So it has a lot of um, things about it that I'm really called to and and I also want to you know start my own online business uh, which I've had a few in the past, but you know, a different one. And so I need to be somewhere where I can access good internet and things like that. So that's where I'm heading. It's a lot hotter there than where I'm currently at. So I feel like I'll be able to remove some more kind of toxic lifestyle choices that I'm currently involved in and feel that if I you know, surround myself with more people that resonate with where I currently am and I can learn more about what I need to do to improve my cellular health even further. And a couple of years ago I was dying and now although I feel healthy, I keep wanting to improve and grow and learn more. So I feel the warmer weather will inspire me to you know, drink more fresh juices and green smoothies and salads instead of being tempted by heavy hot meals and coffee and so on. So I've chosen Sunshine Coast to Queensland as my ideal destination, but I might go to different places along the way before I actually reach that area because I'm actually finding it hard to find work there. And I don't know if that's just because I'm you know, so far away and I'm just not getting a look in or whether there just is a lack of jobs up there. And until I've paid off my van, I really need, I only really need maybe 10 weeks of good pay to sort of get debt free. So I just sort of want to find an option to do that so then I can start my online business. I mean, I could probably start it before that, but this is, you know, where I'm thinking at at the moment. This is where my head's at at the moment. I've just turned 39 years old and I'm passionate about natural healing and optimal living and I'm inspired by people who live in the van because I see it as a freedom lifestyle, a way to get rid of the stuff that holds us back. I always thought that, you know, by now I would have travelled the world but for most of my life I've been stuck by stuff. Having a house full of possessions meant I couldn't just get up and leave whenever I wanted to. Like my stuff was holding me back. I remember even wanting to just move towns and cities and I had a mortgage and you couldn't go in both places and what was I going to do with my stuff if I wanted to move across state and I wanted to move at one stage to Bali or Thailand or anywhere in Asia and I still had this problem of well what am I going to do with my stuff and I can't believe how much that has that decision to stay with your stuff kind of holds you back from living the life that you want to live. And like the van lifestyle for me, it's a freedom lifestyle, a way to downsize my possessions while, you know, keeping the things that I need and, you know, so I'm, you know, I'm comfortable and being able to travel wherever I want to. And I do have a lot of debt, although I've paid almost most of it off over the last few years, really, really, really slowly. But I no longer have a mortgage, I no longer have a credit card and unfortunately I did have to buy the van on finance so once that's paid off, which I intend to do much faster than the loan I took out, I personally will feel free, feel freedom and that's pretty much what I, what I aim for. I don't know if there's any kind of psychological issues there <laughs> that cause my, you know, always desiring freedom kind of feeling or if I'm just waking up to the fact that we're all, you know, debt slaves and and there is a way out and I'm using that the van life as a way to get out.